Okay, we're live. <laughs> All right, sweet. Oh, look, everything just lit up. All right, we'll give people a little bit of time to, to come in here. Uh, for those of you who don't know, we are Kame AI. Uh, this is our open source uh, driving agent, Open Pilot. Uh, it's driving the car right now. Uh, and this isn't some fake stuff. You can, uh, what, everything you see here is already public. You can just go download it. Um, this is an Eon. You can buy it on our shop at shop.com.ai. Uh, it's very nice. Now, of course, since this is a YouTube Live, we're about to show you something that's that's not public, um, so maybe you guys will find it exciting. So, uh, blinker here. Get a little bit to the right, and it'll automatically change lanes for me. Um, so you see here we'll do it on a curve going left. See how it does lane change on the curve. There you go. You gotta show yeah. the wheel. I'll show the wheel. And, uh, we got 15 people. We got 15 people. Maybe we should wait for a few more people to come <laughs> in, and then, we'll, and then we'll demonstrate it again. We'll, we'll make a U-turn. Yeah, Bugsy wanted to see the steering wheel. So Bugsy wanted to see the steering wheel. Right? Yeah. So it's not. Um, it's it's automatic, mm -hmm. but it requires you to look. Um, it doesn't know when it's safe to make the lane change. Um, that's your job uh, as a person. But, yeah, so I'm just yeah. going to drive. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to spin the car around up here while we get some more viewers yeah. on our YouTube Live. I don't even <laughs> think, I, I think that I'm going to do the lane change myself because that's how I've always done it in the past. But you don't have to anymore. You don't have to anymore. Yeah. I mean, we're going we're gonna to get to this refinement of, uh, all right, let's yeah. try. Can I do this one? <laughs> Walkstar is asking the blind spot monitors. It's not linked to the blind spot monitors yet. So any of the cars that can get them on, we're going to add it in before they ships live. Um, and mm. for reference, guys, this is a 07 feature. <laughs> so this, you're going to see a few open pilot releases without this. Um, there's more to this feature than than just lane changing. But just lane changing is all we're going to demonstrate uh, for you guys today. I watched the, I don't know if you guys have seen it, but the, the full self-driving uh, Tesla video. Um, full self-driving Tesla video is very inspiring, and I think we'd like to beat Tesla to shipping all those things. Maybe it's fine. I don't know. We'll see what Tesla yeah. ships this year. See when I ship full self-driving. Maybe, uh, maybe some Scopies. No, what did Tesla promise you guys? What did Tesla promise this year? Now, now it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be saying yeah. this year. It's very alpha feature. <laughs> <laughs> um, but if you guys watched my, uh, can I make a U-turn here? Nah, no, maybe. It doesn't say you can't. If it doesn't say you can't, you can. That's the California way. That's cool. Um, <laughs> oh, it is loud. <laughs> it is. All right. So yeah. Now, and we should be able to use the blind spot monitors on the Toyotas. We should be able to use this, yeah. not the highway as well. Yeah, it should work. Oh, 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 it's, oh, it's gonna double! <laughs> <laughs> I did too. Oh, and it's still doing it. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Well, it switched out of it. Oh, okay. Did, oh, I guess there was no right lane. Yeah, so oh, it didn't stop. Oh, no. See, this is why we gotta use neural networks for everything. Yeah, we can't have any hex to detect when the lane change is over. Exactly. We gotta remove all the hex, guys. <laughs> but this is not. So I know there's some forks with <laughs> open pilot lane changes. Um, this is not hacks. <laughs> this is trained on probably a million lane changes that you guys yeah. did in real life. Maybe a hundred thousand? Yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I think, I think yeah. in order to make this model, it has watched you humans, yeah. users of Open Pilot, yeah. do uh, 100,000 yeah. lane changes. And that's how it yeah. learns to do the perfect lane change for every situation. And that's so, the beauty of deep learning. So yeah, there's a secret input to the model that we normally set to, dr <laughs> to driving straight. <laughs> But when we do the lane change, we just ask the model to do a lane change. <laughs> we're we telling them secrets? I yeah, I did. I guess we're telling the secrets. Yes. It's going to be so, public soon anyway. So there's a question, how is speed controlled during the lane change? Um, so that we don't do anything special with the 
with the speed, but once it starts doing the lane change, the leads should switch. Yeah, the, the leads mm. are predicted by the same model mm. that is very aware of the fact that we're doing the lane change, so it knows which car is the lead mm. car. Uh, so here's a full mm. blinker on. We gotta watch that guy in my, my uh, mm. rear view, but we're good. Yeah, little Start nudge. Lane change, little nudge, automatic lane change. Mm. I wish we could. I wish we could auto turn the blinker off. Oh yeah, that would be nice. That would be nice. Oh, can we? <laughs> can the software do it at all? Like no, it's mechanical. No. Yeah. Um, so we could. Yeah, we could yeah. keep doing it. Oh, oh, we're back. We're back. Yeah, I think if we're in the middle of a lane change maneuver, even if because I'd like to be able to just tap up. Yeah, and, and then nudge. start. Yeah, now and we'll then, cancel. Yeah, I'm, it's gonna cancel. Oh yeah, yes, so that doesn't feel great. Yeah. Did it okay, but yeah. it feels like it like lost. That's the beauty of mm -hmm. neural networks though, it's all fuzzy. <laughs> so like okay. um, and you can make multiple lane changes. Mm -hmm. You just give it one nudge for this one, change lanes. Yeah. And we'll give one nudge for this one, change lanes again, boom. Yeah, so the procedure is you turn on the blinker and then you get for the nudge when you think it's clear. And this is how we're going to proceed with a lot of these sort of features, right? Um, my experience with Navigator and Autopilot is that it increased uh, anxiety in a lot of ways because you weren't sure when the car was going to make the lane change. Um, I'm sitting there and I'm like, from my perspective, it looks totally clear. I have no idea why the car isn't going. Um, part of that can be fixed with communication, but part of that is you want to be in control of your car. Everyone wants a magic wand. Everyone wants a wand that they can wave and like make the lane change, right? But they don't want the wand to tell them what wishes they want. Now, okay, ideally it would monitor your blind spot and tell you when it's safe to go and you just have to press, you know, engage, like, like Captain Picard. But, um... Yeah, but I kind of like the steering wheel to acknowledge the engage. It's yeah. like, it's a nice button to... It is a button. It's yeah. A button. No, this is not in the fell right now. This is a, a very <laughs> a very early preview of Zero Seven. There's gonna be a, a bunch more Zero Six releases first. We've actually stripped these weights out of the model, so good luck trying to add it yourself. <laughs> There's a secret uh, 512 dimensional vector that will enable lane changing in your <laughs> model. <laughs> um, any other questions from that? Uh, can I scroll back? You guys are killing it. Yeah. Thanks, guys. No, I can't see old messages. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, this will mm. be coming. This will be coming to uh, OpenPilot 0.7, uh, available on an Eon near you. Because uh, <laughs> if we run out, you know, yeah. you won't get this. You'll be like, man, I wish I bought an Eon when they didn't run out. Mm. Does the time of day affect the lane change performance? No, it shouldn't. Time of day shouldn't mm. change it. Or like, mm. The way that this mm. thing learned to change lanes was mm. by watching all of your lane changes. Yeah. So if all of your mm. lane changes happen at all times of the day... Yeah. yeah, and you have to keep the blinker on right now during the lane change, but that might change. How many lines of code is the lane change? Uh, maybe it's like 50. 50 lines? Yeah. Like everything is deep learning. I think once you're, yeah, once it's like committed to the lane change, once maybe you're yeah. for half a second. Oh, oh, uh, uh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this needs some work. It wanted to go for the double there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we need a better way to detect when the lane change is done. When the lane change is done, yeah. Yeah, now we have some hacky way by looking at the lane. Oh, yeah, I guess, yeah, I guess that was the problem. I just thought it was. Uh, yeah. Low the speed here. This should be, and this is an example of like people think open pilot is only for the highway, but um, no, I don't, you know, no, pissing this guy off just because I turn the speed down. But people think open pilot is only for the highway, it's not, uh, it works decently well in places like this. Oh. Well, yeah. Yeah, so there is a text, text like stream command to turn the blinkers on, but that's like a very debuggy command and it stops working when the car moves. So maybe just a different one, but I haven't found it yet. Yeah, if anyone figures out how to turn the blinkers on. Yeah. We'll, 
Well, I guess we won't do that to the ship now. Like there's, there's no point in a level two system to auto. Well, if we could automatically turn it off, that's a whole different thing. But yeah, but then the stalker's still there, well, so. I don't know. Is there? There's not a way to. Uh... I mean, maybe if you put it in a debug mode, it will. It won't work anymore. But. No, I'm wondering. Is there a way to electronically pop the stalk, or is that is the no. turn back just mechanical? I think it's mechanical. Mm. Is it? Hmm. Yeah, my, in my parents' new BMW, it's just not physical anymore. So it's like a double press talk. Hang on, hang on, I can tell. No. It's well, not, Bo it's Boxy says it's mechanical, but... It's, oh, yeah, maybe... maybe no, it's, it's the wrong It's street. actually weird. Oh, oops. Yeah, well, sorry. <laughs> well, actually, we're going to make a small detour. <laughs> it's weird, like... Oh, I'm going to have to make a big detour, man. Yeah, I have to make, like, oh, three... Oh, mistake! I have to make, like, three rights now. What a mistake! Uh, <laughs> well, we're learning about how the uh, automatic blinker all works. <laughs> so, any more questions about the lane change? people again uh, 24 24 where are all the people well, I guess we didn't post on Twitter, post on Twitter. yeah who follows us on YouTube no well 24 one. people apparently 24 people you're right it is all about that Twitter yeah that was nice about the scopies and everyone got a notification oh because it was Twitter related mm. yeah didn't like so that. so a while ago apparently you said we're we're never gonna ship automatic lane change what changed well <laughs> all right so here's what changed Tesla, we're never going to ship stop signs until Tesla does, right? So we're like, you know, it's a waste of time to even think about stop signs until Tesla's figured it out, right? Because maybe it's really hard and we can let them figure out whether it's really hard or not. But they've already figured out lane changes and it actually turns out to be easy, let's say. Oh, oh, look at this, a lane change through an intersection. See, now what can do that? Only us. <laughs> So we were never going to ship adjustable following distance. Wait, we're not, though. <laughs> no, that's, uh, <laughs> adjustable following distance is bullshit. No, 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 no. We have to ship. Did I ever say, did I say we were never going to ship automatic lane change? I don't know. Maybe you did. I no. Mean, it's not. It's, 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 um, you do the lane change. It does it for you, but. Yeah, I think we should call it assisted lane change. Assisted lane change. Yeah, I that think that's like. Much more regulator friendly. Yeah, Greg came up with that. I like yeah. it. Yeah, no. <laughs> didn't, didn't, didn't. What is Alka? Yeah, that's like automatic. Is that a real thing or did like Arn make that up? I think it was Arn that made it. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Scopies. Oh, when is the next Minecraft stream? Oh, uh, maybe I'll stream tonight actually. I was thinking about streaming, but maybe nap first and then stream. Not cool. Minecraft though. Hacker rank. Bye. Hacker rank. <laughs>